What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to tell you six running hacks that all runners should know. Alright guys, so I've been running for about 10 to 12 years now, and along the way I picked up a few tricks that make running a little bit more pleasant, a little bit more easier, just a better overall experience, and I'm going to tell you those hacks right now. So the first hack that I have is for those runners that want to wake up early in the morning, maybe you have a race to do, or maybe you just want to do early morning runs, and that's for you to sleep in your running clothes. So when you sleep in your running clothes, you have one less thing to think about in the morning. You have a little bit more time to sleep because you already have your running clothes set out. Uh, for me, I sleep in my running shorts. I usually don't wear a shirt to bed, but what I do with my shirt is put it right next to my running shoes so that way I just jump out of bed put on my shirt put on my shoes and I'm out the door ready to go out for a run or go out to that race and this is easier that way and if you have your running clothes on you already have that mindset in your head that you're gonna go run in the morning so you go ahead and do it all right so my second tip like I said before you go to sleep in your running clothes the next thing I want you to do is shower in your running clothes you know runners we run like all the time for me in my training plan that I should be following that I'm not really following too closely I run every every day. So what I do sometimes to save some time, save some money, is to go ahead and wash my clothes while I take a shower. I just go in with my running clothes and I soap them up in the shower. You know, I can use it as a loofah, do whatever, wring them out, rinse them out, and I hang them out to dry. It's a good way to, you know, get your running clothes clean every day because we do pile up a lot of running clothes with all the miles that we run. So definitely you want to save some time, save some money, wear your running clothes in the shower, wash them, and you'll have a little bit less laundry to do during the week. All right, for my third running hack, this is for nutrition on the run, especially for those long runs. If you want to carry your nutrition and you don't want your pocket stuffed with all those goo packets, what you can do is actually get a safety pin, get your goo packet, and stick it through the top over here, and then you pin this into your running shorts. What I like to do is pin it on the inside and then fold it in. That way it's not all bouncy. You could put about six of them on your shorts, and then what you do is just take it out. These things will come out easily if you just pull on it, it just comes out and then you just take the top off and then you're good to go. You have your nutrition on the run. So definitely safety pin your nutrition to your shorts. All right, so my fourth running hack is for all you sweaty runners. You know, when you're sweating, especially here in Texas, you sweat and sweat gets everywhere. Sweat gets in your eyes. So how do you prevent sweat from getting in your eyes? One tip that I have for you is to use Vaseline or some kind of oil-based product, you know, like this trail toes over here or even chapstick. This is going to repel water. And the way that you do this to repel water and repel sweat away from your eyes is to put a layer of Vaseline or chapstick right above your eye and like leave it down there so that when the sweat drips from your forehead it will go away from your eyes and down into your ears so you just want to put a line right over here and put it down so that it goes away vaseline or chapstick can help on those sweaty days when sweat is getting everywhere and you don't want it in your eyes it's really going to be a lifesaver for you on your runs all right, so my fifth running hack has to do with your socks. So if you ever run and get a lot of blisters, maybe it's because of your socks, because some socks have a lot of inseams on them. Like you see these socks right here. If you look on the inside of them, you can see there's a lot of things going on. All that, all those loose inseams can potentially cause a blister. So you don't want that on there. So my tip for running socks is to actually wear them just like this, wear them inside out. So if you're wearing them inside out, you don't have any of those inseams. So look, look right there, there's no inseams on the outside. So basically turn your socks inside out and wear them inside out. That way none of the inseams are gonna bother you and they won't cause blisters. All right, so for my last running hack, that has to do with deodorant. You know, all runners should definitely wear deodorant. You know, you, you get stinky, you don't wanna get stinky, wear deodorant but it's also good for chafing. If you don't want to buy those expensive chafing sticks that they sell, you know, Body Glide or the Under Armour type, you could simply just wear deodorant. You just put deodorant in whatever area is prone to chafing, like in between your thighs, you know, under your arm. That's a shave prone area for me. Just put it everywhere. So yeah, deodorant for shaving is definitely a great running hack that you should know. Alright guys, so those are all my running hacks. If you guys don't know who I am, I am the Goku Runner. I run 5Ks all the way to the Ultra Marathon distance. I do a lot of running talks like this, do race videos. So subscribe to my channel if you guys want to. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.